Hey, it's Bonnie. Happy Tuesday. I am back. Oh my goodness, you guys. My allergies are just getting worse by the minute. I still see that like white fluffy stuff like floating by. So yeah, I'm in, um, I'm in a bad allergy moment here. But the nice thing is I can still smell everything. Um, my eyes are just kind of watering and it's just like awful, awful allergy time here. It is the end of May. It's funny. I can tell what day it is um, by just the white stuff flying. Uh, here in Ohio, usually around like June 4th, it peaks and you can actually see it almost looks like snow on the ground, all this like white fluffy tree stuff. And one of my worst allergies is trees. So <laughs> uh, bear with me with the allergies. Uh, but guess what? I got some groovy going on. I need my Greg Brady uh, Johnny Bravo t-shirt. It's in the it's in the laundry. Groovy Collection Golden Sunflower. This is truly a golden 70s type of color. Uh, remember, like, everybody had, like, a green refrigerator and um, a yellow couch in, like, the 70s. The colors were so bad. Orange was another color uh, that was really hot. So... I know everyone's going to be wanting groovy watermelon for semi-annual sale, rainbow waves, and uh, the Disco Daydream. I reviewed Disco Daydream. That's when I had my Johnny Bravo t-shirt on. But I wanted to talk about Golden Sunflower uh, before Friday. So I only have the shower gel, but I'm going to put a screenshot up. Check it out. This might jog your memory. Remember Golden Sunflower when it was released? I think this was like three years ago. Uh, Lavender and Bloom. And was it Black Cherry Merlot? Uh, I'm going to put another screenshot up right here. I found one of mine. Uh, that was the Lavender and Bloom. Remember how pretty that one was? Oh my gosh. And we basically had everything with the Golden Sunflower. So, well, I kind of miss the old Golden Sunflower packaging because it was beautiful. I mean, it was pure, like, late summer, gorgeous sunflower. Um, there's something really delightful that, like, makes me want to start macrameing. Is that a word, macrameing? <laughs> I want to create some macrame. <laughs> um, or crochet. I want to start crocheting granny squares. <laughs> I love crocheting. Um, seriously, it's got like a funky 70s vibe going on. And the color is so outrageous. So if you've never tried golden sunflower, it is sunflower petals, orange flower, and fresh vanilla. It's really nice, you guys. Um, it's not like a favorite of mine. I would say it's in the family of like a cactus blossom, which supposedly supposedly is coming back. I know a lot of people are excited about cactus blossom. But what it is, is it's kind of fruity, dry, floral, and um, it's got a touch of orange in it, which is really interesting. Uh, sunflower petals is kind of obtuse because it's like, what does a sunflower smell like? But think about like um, deep dried flowers, the hint of orange in there, and then uh, fresh vanilla. Although it doesn't smell, it doesn't smell like a sunflower creamsicle. <laughs> it's not like that kind of vanilla. It's not like a foodie vanilla. It's more of a... Um, just a dash of vanilla. I think it just gives it like a creaminess. Uh, I think without the vanilla, this would be way too like sharp and pungent, but the vanilla just kind of gives it a vibe. Um, but it is, it's like a dry floral touch of orange. I know a lot of people love this one. So if you've got golden sunflower still, uh, leave me a comment below. I'm curious to see what everyone else thinks. Um, of the uh, groovy collection, obviously groovy watermelon is like my favorite because it's pink watermelon blast. Give me the sugar. Oh my gosh, you know me and sugar. This one smells, oh my gosh. Like I can't stop smelling this one. Oh yeah, <laughs> this one's so good. I like the sugar, uh, but if you like the drier scents, uh, you're going to love Golden Sunflower. 
I need to review uh, the Rainbow Waves, which I got my baby bop bag here. I was just grabbing bags and throwing product in them just to clean my desk up. Do I have the, um, where did it go? Oh my gosh, this is all of the, um, at the beach. It's not where I put my rainbow waves. Where did I put it, you guys? It's around here somewhere. I was trying to get organized uh, for some of my annual stuff because I have so much product on my desk. I want to do, like, on Thursday, my top 10 favorite semi-annual sale products. Like, we're going to be ranking all of this stuff, uh, like the uh, whipped coconut milkshake, um, Juniper Breeze, like all of the new stuff. I'm so excited about this video. But I will find everything. What the heck did I do? With oh, here, 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 here. I got my Bath and Body Works bag over here. Oh, yeah. So this is Disco Daydream. <laughs> if you didn't see my earlier video. And this is Rainbow Waves, which was the Pride collection uh, for last year. And then uh, what else do I have in here? What else do I have in my bag? Oh, I got some Golden Mango Lagoon. Um... Oh, my fruity sherbet scoop. I'm going to put this in the shower. I tried it out once and I loved it. I'm going to use a little bit more of that. That, I, I got to put that in the shower. So I'm, I'm kind of organizing myself here. <laughs> you don't want to see my desk. <laughs> Life of a vlogger, the other side. So get ready. Groovy collection, I'm hearing, is going to be 50% off. Um, the shower gels are $13.50. So, you know, half of $13.50. Uh, these are $16.95. I'm guessing the cream is going to be $16.95. I want the entire collection of the body cream. I'm going to use that to like polish my furniture. I'm going to wear the groovy watermelon. Um, I'm going to have that like whole Johnny Bravo, uh, scene going on. <laughs> Little does my husband know the whole room is going to get like a lot groovier. <laughs> On the dresser. Anyway, oh my goodness, you guys, I'm excited. Let me know uh, what you think of Golden Sunflower, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.